Alexander making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. Defending his belt yet again. This has been one dominant 155 pound fighter, ladies and gentlemen. You know, this is a belt that frequently changes hands. Well, it hasn't since it's been wrapped around this guy's waist, given all the skills he brings to the table. The question is fighting a challenger like this, can he hold on to the belt? If he can, just another chapter in the greatness of one of the best lightweights this octagon has ever seen. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. It's who does he first? Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, two inches tall, weighing in at 116 pounds. Fighting out of St. Petersburg, Russia, presenting the challenger, Big. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. UFC belt on the line. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who's really good. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Big call for punch land. Now we get back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. Big kick. Straight right, he misses. All right, early round one, we'll see if he can use that jab and try to keep his opponent on the outside. Must be nice for these long fights, huh? I mean, they are able to touch you as you try to enter into range. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, straight right. Oh, that kick is good by Lee. 
guy's throwing early. And they set him. Just misses there with the left. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds the knockout. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Oh, massive kick. Didn't see that one coming. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Nice head kick. Ooh, what a punch. Lee's hook shot is blocked. Saw that coming from a mile away. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Pretty good right hand. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Nice punch there. Able to check that kick as well. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Big kick lands. Misses with the right hand. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. What a head kick. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Punch is blocked. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just out of range with that right hook. Left hand punch with the clinch. about this approach here tonight. Technical striker, and he has gone mad. Very accurate, but really just an all-out aggressive. Over the top, this fight's gonna be over this What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, but he's going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, big punch land. Final seconds. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. And both guys really throwing with authority. Great. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you gotta think the knockdown is gonna be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this, you're winning. And you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. Let's relax. Excellent work. All those rounds on the pads in the gym have paid off. Now we're going to continue. Keep doing exactly what you're doing. Are you ready? Are you ready? Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. And he caught the kick. Oh, is that a huge 
punch kick to the body or what? That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> Nice job to land the knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Nice head kick. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations. Tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jet. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there. And offensively, he hasn't been a wool beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent. Not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head movement and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Nice kick. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. Big leg kick lands. Knee strike coming, it is blocked. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Continues to miss. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Just misses with that big right hand. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Nice punch, Lance. Oh, big head kick. Tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. They continue to exchange. Just missed with the left there. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Campbell in. Shots that if you take one of them, if you end the night, that one landed right on the spot. So he's really starting to put together. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Over and over, he landed his big body kick. 20 seconds to go, round two. Visibly limping here. 10 seconds now to go in the round. Just missed with the straight left hand. So a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. Here we go with 
this third round of this championship fight. of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Nice strike. Nice. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Forget the turtle in that kick. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Big head kick lands. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Lee gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Oh, swelling and blood. You wonder if at some point that's gonna impact the breathing. Not a good situation for him here. Nice strike. Put your hands up higher. Come on. Nice leg kick. Starting to do some really significant damage. Oh, he's got him right here. Ooh, diving punch oh, hands. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. You gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Strong bottom work here. Staying busy. Gets up again here, but hurting. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Slips. Just over two minutes to go. Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you gotta be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Head kick, that's a miss. What a punch. <laughs> Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Just unable to quite find that range. Big head kick land. Lee gets caught with that punch. shot that ended the fight but both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart one guy got the finish but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 13 seconds of the third round. We play the winner by knockout and still. So there he is, the still undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world and certainly getting the title defender with style points here tonight. He's your winner by now. He's just a great fighter. He does everything the right way, lands a beautiful shot to end the fight, keeps it.